Time now for Better Money Boston. Nick Colantuno is a certified financial planner with Johnson Brunetti. You know, Nick, a lot of people wonder about long-term care. We know it's expensive, but many of us just want to know, is it right for me? How do we decide? Well, Megan, I think the first thing you have to think about are just the facts of the matter. You know, seven out of 10 Americans will face some sort of long-term care need as they enter their retirement years or especially progress through them. Now, there are a number of different stages to that. The most common form is, you know, hiring a home health aide to come in and cook and clean, maybe administer medication a couple days a week. You then graduate to a more higher end or more sophisticated level of care. Maybe that's an assisted living facility or a memory care unit. And then those final stages, this is where none of us wanna end up, a nursing home or some sort of a hospice scenario. So you need to address each one of those phases because let's face it, the costs are going up and it can be a, a pretty big burden, if not for you, for your kids. When we're trying to understand if it's a right solution for us, should we be looking at our family health history at all? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, it's important for everyone to think about, but keep in mind, if you have pre-existing conditions in your family or maybe a history of certain conditions that you know you're probably going to be in a scenario like this in the future, you want to make sure you're doing everything you can while you're now younger and healthier to prevent you know, any sort of burden facing your family in the future. Absolutely, and long-term care, the good thing is it's evolved over the years, so we do have some options here. Walk us through some of those. There's a number of different types. They come in all different shapes and sizes. You can structure them in all different ways, but there's really, the skinny of it is there's two options, right? You can either qualify for it based on medical underwriting, similar to a life insurance policy where you're paying a monthly premium, and let's face it, if you never use it, all that premium is, is gone. The insurance company keeps it. Another more popular alternative today, especially with healthcare costs and the, just the cost of paying for those premiums each month, is what is called an asset-based hybrid policy, where maybe you're taking a chunk of money one time and putting it into a vehicle where if you need it for long-term care, it can start generating the income you need to pay those expensive bills. All right, long-term care, it's a big topic. You have a free book on it. We sure do. How do you address the long-term care needs? We want to give it to every one of you watching. You can get it today for free. Go to bettermoneyboston.com.